Talk to me a little bit about this transatlantic relationship between Europe and the U.S. How difficult is it? How difficult is it to reset it? Well, we've seen dramatic changes after President Trump took office. Uh, so many agreements from the Paris climate deal to the nuclear agreement with Iran to anything in terms of trade relations and a values-based relation that we've cherished since World War II has really been upset. And uh, I'm worried. Uh, my transatlantic heart has been uh, suffering from this upset. And I think that uh, we're not at the bottom of this. So I really hope that we can look beyond government to government, White House to uh, other politicians in Europe and look at the depth of the transatlantic relation that also leans on business relationships, people's relationships, and, and that's crucial right now. And of course, relations between parliaments uh, with the House of Representatives and us in the European Parliament is also an important buffer here. Do, do the midterms change anything depending on which way it goes? So if there's an upset and if there's, for example, two, you know, two Republican, like both the House and, and, yeah. and the Senate, or the other way, if the Democrats get both? Well, the world is watching the midterm elections, I think, more than ever before. And I believe that in every system, checks and balances are good. But especially now, because there's so much at stake with such a dramatic shift from American leadership that is based on morals, that is based on shared values across the Atlantic. The institutional support for multilateralism has really been lacking under President Trump. And these are all points that really hurt the transatlantic relations. So I hope that they can be rebalanced with uh, well, pushback from the House and the Senate. But I have to say we've seen that regardless of the outcome of this midterm, that there have been checks and balances coming from Congress. But I think we could use some more to avoid that we're being played a part at such a crucial moment of changes in the world as well.